What's up, what's up all you clashers out there? This is Galaxis and I have Valentina gameplay for you guys, man. She just came out this morning. I got hella lucky, man. My son, my vice leader, was getting ready for high school this morning. He's a junior in high school. He's getting ready, man, trying to, you know, get everything set up. And he said, man, I'm going to roll a couple accounts. He rolled Valentina. It is totally awesome, man. And, uh, you know, she's a beast, dude. You got to check it out. We're going to go through, do a little bit of gameplay. But uh, she is a game changer. It is going to be awesome to be able to have her, man. I can't wait to get a chance to roll her on the U.S. server. But uh, there she is, man. Valentina. She's a beast, man. You know, check out. Uh, you know, I can't exactly read what it says, but I think it's giving 2% uh, or uh, 7% energy to two people. 7% for with like a six-second cooldown maybe or every... I'm not exactly sure what that is. But, uh, you know, basically she is... Uh, Procking and giving everybody energy and uh, you know, she's immune to uh, being stunned by Aries So let's get her in there. Let's take a look real quick. Let's see man. We're gonna see we're gonna land her here on the side and uh, Let's try and find a better base that we can uh, we can go at real quick we have a more tip see if he can take out some of these troops, but uh, looks like See, Mortep isn't doing too good down there. We might have to jam him back. But what we're really trying to see is we're trying to see Valentina's proc. Oh, my God. Did you see that? Man, that proc is amazing. That was like a, the radius on that is. There it goes again. Oh, wow. That's what I'm talking about, man. She is a beast. Are you serious? The radius on that proc is like amazing. Now, what she does, it looks like she's giving... Every time her proc goes off, everybody who is in the radius of that, all of your heroes are picking up energy. You can see Ares bar just popped up right there. So we'll go out ahead and gem back our Immortep because we did lose Immortep. So let's go ahead. We'll gem him back. Hate to gem back heroes, but I do want to have him to be able to do the rest of this gameplay. So um, really quick, I'm thinking let's go ahead and name this my son, Xander. He's the guy who rolled this. So, uh, you know, and... and We'll go ahead and put this in as Xander. Uh, I guess, I'm thinking, I guess maybe Xander uh, of the EES. He's, his account is Xander1987 on the US server. But uh, we'll just probably put it Xander of the EE, maybe. Of the EE. See if that works. Because he is the vice leader of the Eternal Elites, my uh, vice leader of my guild. So, uh, see, we got that name. That way we can go ahead and go in, do some arena gameplay and stuff like that. So, we got to get our arena out there. Let's go ahead and go and uh, pull that up real quick get the arena out and you know I know it's gonna probably be a little bit difficult to find because this is you know a brand new account going into the arena um, actually we'll drop this magic in real quick uh, what I want to be able to do is just make sure that our guy doesn't heal again so we got him named we can do some arena gameplay let's uh, let's go ahead and do a little bit more rating real quick and I want to do some arena gameplay and just sort of you know, get an idea of what she is capable of doing. So let's see, let's drop her in here. Um, we'll drop in over on this side here real quick and we'll sort of see if we can see her proc going off and what it's able to do to uh, to get this going. Okay, yeah. Let's see, more tep is going off and then she goes off and everybody there got energy. That is amazing. Man, she is a game changer. She's about to proc again. And did you see the energy just go up? Let's see here. Maybe this is a little bit better if we don't lose that Immortep. There. You see that? His whole bar filled up. So, I mean, it's not instantaneous. It's like every second that they're in there or something, they get energy from it. But, I mean, the radius of that is amazing. So, basically, anybody around her, anywhere on the map, is going to be getting energy. Lots of energy from her. And, you know... She can't be stopped, so Ares won't be able to take her out of her proc. And, you know, basically, she's going to be a god, man. You know, they just gave us a pretty awesome hero. And she is a gem, a gem roll hero because we rolled her with gems this morning. So thank you, IGG, man. You hooked it up. That's what's up. Keep on doing this here real quick and just get an idea. Look at the radius of that proc. So go ahead and get on out of here and I think we'll go and... Uh, do a little bit more. Get, make sure we got our magic real quick. But yeah, the radius on her proc is just pretty amazing, man. You know, pretty amazing. I'm like, man, I cannot wait to have her because I don't have Aries. And there's a lot of guys that are just doing me so much damage, you know, in the Lost Realm, Lost Battlefield. 
Not so much Lost Battlefield, but the Lost Realm, definitely. Guys with Ares taking my altars from me, man. It's very difficult, even with Dread Drake and a couple other good guys. Very difficult to take them out. But uh, Valentina, she is going to change the game, man. She's going to help. She's going to give all your guys energy. And she's going to take away, uh, you know, energy from... The, well, I don't know if she actually takes away energy. I don't think she really takes away energy. She just gives all your guys energy. So that's pretty awesome. We'll go ahead and see a little bit more gameplay. And then we'll do a little bit of arena. But man, oh man. And her look is pretty awesome too. She's she's a floater. Now this one does have, uh, I think, a level 3 sprint. So she's moving a little bit faster than she normally does. But, you know, her attack rate is decent. So she's continuing to uh, proc. And every time she procs, everybody in the radius gets energy. Uh, it's really going to help your guys out, man. Pretty amazing. Yeah, everybody's been asking for a, a decent, you know, gem roll hero. Well, shardable would be awesome if we could get a nice shardable hero, but you can't be mad, uh, you know, with getting the opportunity to get her. Ares has just ruled forever, and now, you know, with Valentina in the game, uh, it's really just going to change. It's going to change a lot of things. So, guys are going to, some guys are going to be mad. Some guys are going to hate. Guys are going to say, man, you know, Valentina sucks, man, because it's going to take away the power that they've had to be able to control, uh, you know, arena and and lost, uh, lost realm and stuff like that. So, I mean, you know, what we have on our hands here is a game changer, you guys, straight up, you know. And uh, I'm just really happy that I was able to get a chance to do this gameplay for you guys, man. You know, really appreciate everybody coming and checking it out. You see, man, she is pretty awesome. She's gonna proc and then look at the more tap. Got all of his energy there. Pretty awesome, pretty awesome gameplay there, man. She is, she is tight, and her range I think is what is. I, have to, I think that's a four, three or four range. So she's a pretty, pretty nice ranged hero. That's pretty awesome. Uh, let's go ahead and we actually don't have our arena out, so let's go ahead and get the arena out real quick. And we can go ahead and get in and do some arena now. You know, this is a brand new account in the arena, so I'm not gonna really find a lot of, uh, you know, people that we can that we can really do battle with, but we can get in there and see what's up. So they're gonna want me to, uh, yeah, I need to go ahead and set up all of my, all of my guys here, get my defense set up, get my attack set. Well, I'll just do the attack. We don't even need to do defense right now, but go ahead and we will attack this, uh, this first person. Now let's see if they have any heroes. Usually when you first enter, uh, you know into the arena that the people don't really have any heroes So we're gonna have to yeah, see that that's a level one frost witch So gonna have to go through a little bit of this but man. I mean, you know, this is this is really an awesome hero guys straight up I mean, you know, we've we've seen a lot of different legendaries be introduced But this one right here giving everybody energy It's like, a, you know, a new cupid for everybody and it's really gonna give everybody a chance to uh, you know, to roll that, to be able to roll that. You hear my grandson talking in the background there, little guy, future clasher. <laughs> but uh, yeah, man, this is how it is. She is pretty awesome. Now you know we're not really seeing any competition here in the arena, so that sort of sort of sucks. We need to get down to somebody that has a few more heroes. So we got to go through a couple of these guys. But uh, everybody's gonna have an opportunity to roll her, so you can only imagine what this is gonna do to the game and how it's going to change things. You know, a lot of guys that have had Ares have been able to dominate in the arena and you know, been able to dominate in uh, different game modes, and now they're not gonna be able to do that. Her her radius is so large that um, you know she's gonna affect rating. She's just going to really affect everything and, you know, all the way around. And you can only imagine if you have a Cupid out there and you have Valentina out there, you're really going to just have a lot going good for you, man. A lot of energy coming. So, I mean, I guess you can sort of think of her, uh, you know, her, the radius or her proc, sort of like what a Ghoulam would do. But instead of giving, uh, you know, health back, she's going to be giving energy back to everybody in that, in that radius. So it's pretty awesome. Pretty awesome effect, and you know the effect of the effect that they put on that is sort of like the ground pound that you get with Destroyer. 
you know, when he when he hits the ground and you see that big radius on it, you know, because her the radius on it is, is pretty awesome. See this, we're not even gonna get a chance to see her proc. I'm just trying to get some through some of these guys so we can find somebody uh, you know, that we can actually do a little bit of battle with. Got a couple more attempts. So we could try well actually the Santa Boom guy. Maybe we'll look at the Santa Boom guy. Santa Boom guy probably has a pretty strong crew. We might actually get murdered. Yeah, yeah, this guy. This guy is pretty strong. I don't know if that's going to work. But Valentina, here she is going up against uh, Death Knight. So you see she's not taking energy from him. She's just uh, giving energy to all of her guys there that are in that radius. So anybody in the radius is going to be able to pick up and get energy. It's going to help proc. But, I mean, these guys are pretty, pretty strong. So we're not able to actually um, do anything with it. You know, it's not really making much of a difference. But... Uh, let's see, we'll try one more. We got one more attempt. Let's see if we can get a decent person to battle here. Yeah, this isn't too bad. So we got some guys here. I think we'll, won't have much of a problem taking these guys out. So what we're looking at now is her proc. When it goes off, you can see everybody got energy right there. So you can imagine what this will be like on high level arena. Uh, you know, she's in there. And uh, when she procs, everybody gets energy. So if your Cupid is going off, I mean, I have a five a five revitalized Cupid. So my Cupid is gonna go off instantly, give her energy and allow her to proc and give everybody, so it can sort of be like a chain, uh, you know, a chain effect, something going on like that, where they're getting, I guess, a chain energy effect. Because, uh, you know, Cupid will be proccing and then it'll instantly allow her to proc and that's gonna, you know, well, if you got, if you got like a, even a level two revite on her, would uh, you know would allow you to be able to instantly proc if you have a level five cupid so i mean you know this is gonna be pretty sweet man valentina her look is tight she got that scepter that is what's up so there you go guys got some gameplay for you guys got it up so hopefully everybody enjoys that and what's this button here yeah that's pretty tight you're able to have different configurations of heroes so i'm not exactly sure how that works out but i think that might be what they were talking about as far as the you know the different sets of heroes that you can have for different game modes um you know that decides who's on your base i think so that's pretty cool something that we needed and one other thing i was looking for was totems i wanted to see the totems are probably something that isn't going to be available till you get to a higher town hall and you see it's not anywhere on the list here so totems will have to be later on when you get to a higher town hall so you know when we get those on the u.s server i'll do a video on that for you guys but hey, I want to thank everybody for continuing to support my channel, guys. And if you like that video, you like the style that I got here, make sure that you click that like and subscribe button, guys. Subscribe to my channel and just keep on helping me to keep growing, guys. Until next time, Galaxis out.